Alchemy of Souls Season 1 has already ended. All I can is this is the most depressing finale that I've been watched indeed great work from the Hong sister. I can't believe that Alchemy of Souls ended Season 1 like this. What a cliffhanger. For the preview for Alchemy of Souls Season 1, we have the chance to see the sneak peek appearance of Naksu. She's indeed alive, but how? She will forget Jang Wook. How come did she come alive after the petrified the Mudox body? Now, TVN released all the appearances that appear in Season 2. It included Seo Yul, Park Dangu, Cho Yeon, Kim Duju, The Crown Prince, Master Li, Park Jin, Future King Jang Wook, Naksu, Lady Jin, and our evil Jin Mu still included for the second season. The season to preview revealed how the cast powerful is. After the ending of season 1, we can't see that Jang Wook became the powerful and strong king he is. He is still using the sword and Tansu skill that Naksu taught him. Jang Wook appearance becomes fierce and bolder, but why do I have the feeling that he will forget Naksu and choose to become a king? After that happened, he will grow anger and hatred in his heart. He will be forced himself just to forget Naksu. Jin Choi and will be different from the season 1. After Naksu killed her father, she promised that she will get find Naksu to kill her. Also Lady Jin appeared in the preview with an anger look. Maybe in the second season will reveal that Mudok was Bu Yun. And for Jin Mu, our villain is still there and alive. I know he's not gonna stop for being villain in the story. So what will happen to Naksu? She will be going to remember her pupil and love one Jang Wook. Jin Mu still influence Naksu and still using her? More updates, your favorite drama couple and your favorite drama. Comment, like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much.